What's going on everyone? Thank you for tuning in again to Sneaker Junkie TV and I apologize in the delay for making this video but today I will be showing you how to paint splatter your shoes and I will be doing it to this pair of you know some generic sneakers from Urban Outfitters. Now if you've been subscribed to my channel you've probably seen the video that I did where I restored and customized a pair of Uptowns and I did the same paint splatter thing to them and I got a lot of comments from people asking me to do a tutorial on how to do the paint splatter so even though I don't have any Uptowns available right now to splat paint on i owe you guys a paint splatter tutorial so here it is so the first thing that you're going to need is some acetone you can get this at any local hardware store then you're going to want to get some blue painters tape you could get this at any arts and crafts store i got mine from angelusdirect.com you're going to need some cotton rounds you could get this at your local pharmacy you're also going to need some sem sand free adhesion promoter and you could get this online at amazon and also you're going to need a paintbrush and last but not least you're going to need your paint and for the purpose of this video i'll be using red white yellow and i might throw in another color later so the first thing you want to do is strip the factory varnish off the parts of the shoe that you're going to splat paint on and to do that you get your acetone and your cotton rounds pour a little acetone onto your cotton rounds and then start rubbing down the shoe and as you wipe the shoe down with the acetone you should see the color of the shoe wiping off onto the cotton round just don't rub too hard or too long because you can damage the shoe now after you've prepped the leather with the acetone you also want to prep the rubber portion of the shoe and that's where the sem comes in so you spray a couple coats of this on there let it dry and then you will be ready to paint all right so now that we have the shoe prepped you want to get like a, a little old brush and just scrub down the shoe to make sure there's no debris or dust or dirt on there and the next step is taping off the shoelaces in case you don't want to get any paint on them and now we can begin painting so you want to take your brush and dip it into your paint and try to get a generous amount of paint on there because you want the paint to be able to flick off the brush if you only put a tiny bit on there the paint won't really fly off the brush and practice makes perfect you probably won't get it right the first time which is why i suggest practice practicing on like a piece of loose leaf or computer paper and that's exactly what i did when i first started out i get a piece of computer paper and practice flicking the paint with my hand and with the brush and it's really all about experimenting and once you're good with splatting the paint the way you want to on the computer paper all you got to do is take it to the shoes so here's how the splat looks after putting one color and after you get your first color on there you want to let that dry before you put on another color so it's the same process just dip the paintbrush in the paint start flicking and that's it all right so we got two colors on there we let those dry now we're gonna add white and i'm really just gonna keep doing the same thing over and over again with each color oh and i forgot to add that you want to wash off your brush after putting on each color because you don't want to mix colors so yeah here is basically the finished product i got all the colors on there red white yellow and i put a little blue too and i feel like they came out really good now the last step when you paint splat your shoes is to apply a finisher and what i'll use to finish this off is krylon matte finish so you just want to spray across the shoe wherever you painted light and even you want to go from left to right or right to left and and don't focus on one spot for too long because then the finisher will start to cake up and there you have it that's really all there is to it your paint splattered sneakers are done thank you for watching this video i hope y'all enjoyed it and stay tuned for the next one